and friends. And I want them to be safe. So stay safe. I'm scared, but I need to fight. Start from February, we all protested peacefully. But they barely attacked us. So there is only one way left. When I am stay at Tiengo, when we see the soldier, we will escape. And then night time is scary because they are coming to so many people's house and then they kill them. So many people are die. So I feel really sad. I can't stay like this anymore. So I decide to come. Every day we have a training. We are training for guerrilla warfare. Four o'clock since morning until seven or eight. The sixth morning we have to do exercise and then we have to make it for the teamwork and then how to hold the gun and then how to shoot the gun. Uh, most of the people are young and the women also they are here. They saw my photo and then they worry for me and then they caught me but I I didn't contact with them. I can see the uh Henley and then do that win win. I know that they cannot come back to Myanmar right now. I hope Myanmar will get back to democracy in the future. I want to shoot the flame or something like this and then after the I have to teach my kids gymnastics and just going travel around the world. So I want to go back to normal life. That's all I need.